Hi everybody, welcome to the astrology chat for November 1st, 2024, the new moon in Scorpio. The key for using this new moon in Scorpio, not just for the next 28 days, but for the rest of what is going to be happening this period, is committing to the process of learning how to identify the root of your pains and your traumas, transforming that process and healing, and then wash and repeat. This new moon in Scorpio is so powerful for allowing yourself to really see where emotionally there's been blocks for you. And we've all been dealing with a lot mentally. We've been dealing things in the physical. We've been dealing with our actions. And now we're getting to the root of it, the unseen power of your emotions. When the moon is in Scorpio, this is about the occult. This is about the unseen. This is about points of release. This also is about your relationship with other people, um, particularly with shared resources um, and just the unseen factors. And Scorpio is ruled by both Pluto and Mars. And so if we look at where Mars is right now, Mars is in Cancer about to go through a very long lesson about how your actions are tied to your emotions. We also have a grand water trine happening with the new moon um, and the sun and with Mars in Cancer and also with a an asteroid Harry's, I believe, in Pisces. But there's this grand trine energy that says if you do the work about understanding your emotions and not just getting stuck in them, but being very focused on I'm transmuting this energy. I'm learning how to use an op new operating system. I'm letting go of resentment. This new moon in Scorpio, Scorpio is a deaf sign. So there is an ending about something for you. And you're like, I'm going to take this energy and I'm going to redirect it. I'm going to transmute it. I'm going to put it in a new space. If there's anything a Scorpio will do, it's heal completely, right? It's that phoenix energy of letting yourself have a spiritual and emotional death so that you can be reborn it's not wallowing it's not being afraid it's transmuting so i would say that's definitely the beautiful energy of this new moon in scorpio i'm a huge fan of this new moon in scorpio i see that it can bring a lot of breakthroughs for you if you allow yourself to do the hard work of learning how to process yourself and your feelings and your emotions in a different way and letting yourself find that the beauty and darkness, which is at the heart of scorpionic energy. It's the ability to see the light in the unseen. Scorpions glow in the dark for a reason. Um, so I love you guys so much. Uh, happy new moon. Happy Samhain for those who celebrate. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.